Hi, welcome back. Today I'm making steak fajitas. And two bell peppers and one large onion. All right, I got the bell peppers all sliced up. Now we're gonna do the onion. Just slice it in half and like that. This is my kind of my own recipe, guys. I made this one up, so there's nothing special about it. That's just what I'm making for dinner. Onions and bell peppers. I'm gonna, I got some steak seasoning for the steaks. They cook, so we got them all sliced up. And now I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you the I'm making Spanish rice. Here, I'm making Spanish rice. I got I got uh, onions, not onions, but I got garlic, tomatoes, and jalapenos in there. This is how I make it, and then I put a chicken bouillon in there for flavoring. And I'm gonna put some onions in there too, guys. Alright, we're gonna put the rice in there and stir it around a little bit and it'll be done. Alright, we're gonna add some seasoning to it. I use that lemon pepper seasoning. I use uh, garlic powder. A bit of that. Of course, I put garlic in it too, so I love garlic. Black pepper, just black pepper, or ground black pepper. Start around and blend the rice to it in a minute. Now, all right, we got this steak, we can cut it in half. It's frozen, so gotta be careful. Yeah, and this is a, uh, a Kansas City strip or strip loin, is what it is. We're gonna cut it up. Make our steak fajitas. Strips like that. We're cooking for four, so we want to we want a lot. And for my Spanish rice, I used uh, two tablespoons of uh, coconut oil. Cook that with, so. If anybody is wondering, I'll set tomatoes, two, two, two tomatoes, and a jalapeno. Let's see, a gin, a, a garlic. I used three cloves of garlic, and then the seasoning that I put in. Okay, we're gonna finish this up. We'll be right back. All right, I just added my rice to my seasoning or sauce and I got my beef all chopped up we're gonna add seasoning to this all right we got the rice in there we got it all mixed up and uh, let me tell you this rice is already good this winter winter chicken dinner okay let's add some spice to our steak Now we're gonna add some carne asada to seasoning. El Mexicano carne asada seasoning. We're gonna add some that to it. I want the flavors cooked into it, so if there's some moisture in the pan, we're gonna add some to it. And we're gonna add some black pepper. Lemon pepper, good old lemon pepper. Give it a little zest. Yeah, a tiny little bit of garlic. All right. Oh, it smells good. Almost done. 
add our peppers and the onion. All right, guys, look at that. Listen to that sound. That sounds good. It smells good. Hi guys, it's ready. I've got the rice done, the Spanish rice. I got my plate ready, tortillas, sour cream, some store-bought guacamole, Yucatan. It's ready guys. Let's eat. Kaun ka and ka kain tayo. Let's eat. Alright, thank you for subscribing to my channel. If you like my, my video, subscribe to my channel. I'd like to thank you for watching. This is amazing, guys. Thank, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one. You've been watching Doug Bryan on my YouTube channel. If you enjoyed today's show, please hit the like button and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.